With any experience that you're delivering, whether it's to your customers or somebody else, it's be different enough to stand out and make it simple enough to easily resonate. He's an author, a speaker, a coach, a podcast host, and so much more. His power is in leveraging simplicity. Your customer is comparing you to every other experience they receive from every other brand. It doesn't take just listening to your customers to understand them. You've got to observe them as well. With all the research that I've done to look into all these simple brands and providing these simple experiences to their customers, I've found that it comes down to six behaviors, just six key behaviors that I've crafted and I've defined into what I refer to as the simple playbook. Simple never stops. I mean, think about it. What was considered simple three years ago, you know isn't considered simple today. And what's considered simple today isn't gonna be what's considered simple three years from now. Innovate to stay ahead. You've gotta be looking at what's coming down the pike for your customers, what's coming down the pike for your industry, and then what changes do you need to make to meet those head on? Minimize barriers. Now, with the experience that you're delivering, there are all kinds of barriers that are preventing your customer from getting the full value of that experience. What can you do to recognize those barriers your customer is facing and then minimize them? The next behavior is prune it back. Expert gardeners know that if you want to get the full value from your plants, if you want to watch your plants thrive, you need to prune them back. And that's just what you need to do with your customer experience. If your customer has an interaction that takes them six steps, what can you do to prune that process back to three steps or two steps or even one step? If you're bombarding your customer with too many options and too many services that are causing them decision fatigue, then what can you do to prune your offerings back and offer a simple solution set to your customer? Lose the jargon. When it comes to your customer, they need to quickly grasp and quickly understand your message. And that's only going to happen when you use clear, concise, and simple language. The last behavior, empathize with your customers. It's truly understanding your customer, understanding all their external challenges and understanding their internal struggles. Understand what it is they go through on a day-to-day -day basis. And then based on that knowledge that you have of your customer, what can you do to offer an experience that meets all of their needs?